Welcome back to the Mods YouTube channel. My name's Michael. Today, we are gonna make fluffy slime. Welcome back to the hangar. We're here with one of our slimologists, Lan. One of the most absolute fun things we love to do here at the museum is make slime. I've been making slime here for almost 20 years, and it has just become more of a art form and a challenge of who can make the better, best, slimiest, crunchiest, stretchiest, Ooh. most colorful slime that we can find. So today we're actually gonna be very specific. We're gonna make a fluffy slime. And the reason we're doing fluffy slime is because everybody I'm sure has made slime at one point or another in school. You've called it booger or snot or whatever it is. So today we're gonna to actually make a fluffy slime. And Lan and I have a little um, competition going on. Yes, Usually we do. makes the better slime. I it's think me. I make the better slime. Do you see you know, this? I'm a little biased in that, in that it, response. I, I, so, Lan, I see you're playing with fluffy slime. So yes, I am. So why don't you tell our viewers exactly what they need to make this fluffy slime? Some regular household items. So you can use um, borax. Most people use borax. This guy over here uses borax. I like to use liquid starch. Or you can find some Tide, um, I want to say dish detergent. You can also find your Elmo's glue and some shaving cream. Look in your dad's cabinet or this guy's cabinet for some shaving cream. <laughs> so I've also heard that um, contact solution works as well to make slime. So that's another good one that you can look around the house for. And the idea here is, you know, it's not anybody believes anything is better than the next. It just kind of is a try and, and see method. It is more of an experimentation method of just try and try until you get exactly what it is you're looking for and what you feel would be a good slime. Some people prefer a wet, gross Sticky. slime. Some people prefer a nice, dry, fun slime like this. So, Lane, let me ask you a question. Yes. If we were to make our own slime now, what's the first thing we're going to start with? We're going to start with glue. Okay, so does it matter if it's like white glue, blue glue? I have clear glue? glue and I have white glue here. They're both Elmer's. It, okay. They both work out. I, I, I'm, I'm going to go with my white glue here. Okay. And so I'm just going to, are we, where, where, what are we doing here? We're just going to take the top off and let's just pour. pour is there a bowl? Nope. Oh, right, on right, the, on the right on the table. Okay, right on the yep. table. Okay, just going to go right on the table. Okay. Beware moms and dads, this is messy. So I'd recommend, as you can see, we have a protective covering on our, our table here, but it doesn't hurt to do this somewhere where you don't mind making a mess. I love making a mess. A sink. I love it. Um, that would help sink. out a lot as well. So the do next I have slime thing? yet? No, we don't have slime yet. We just have regular glue. Okay, so what else do I need that? So I'm gonna to give you here? some Oh, some shaving cream. Some so shaving, shaving cream. cream is actually gonna help create that fluff and it's going to help us that cloud that nice fluff that we want to see i don't know why my eyes isn't working i'm not old enough to use this can you <laughs> all right here i got you okay you're so doing that really you good more. thank you thank you and next we have our okay activator activation and now what is the, the activator if i'm correct it actually brings the glue together, together yes and the bonds start to literally form and hold on to each other so they that won't I go can create anywhere slime. yes okay. and the more you work it the more it dries it out you add more glue you add more liquid starch so so like baking if you're if you like baking with mom or dad um one thing i'm going to recommend is start with a small amount and then add as needed don't just add a lot because the second you add a lot, you're just gonna have to scrap the project and restart again. It's easier to add a little and then add more. So I'm gonna start to get my hands in here. Yep, we're gonna just work it in, just work it in. Wow, this is already coming together. It's not even glue anymore. Yep. It feels really gross. Yes, it does. Mine's is. Parents, if you don't like touching this kind of thing, it doesn't hurt to also wear gloves. Gloves help, but if you do this right, and one fun thing about working with Lan here yes. at the museum is him and I, we do this enough times that we try to make sure that it cleans itself up. But the more you work it, the more it's just going to clean itself right off the surface you're working, and then you'll be able to play with it in your hands. One thing I would highly recommend, parents, you're not washing this down the drain. No, not down the drain. it is still glue. So it will dry in the drain, and then you'll have a bigger issue in that respect. So I don't simple, know. You're, when, once you're done playing with it, it's pretty good. And it's dried out. You can just dispose of it in the garbage. Now, what about keep time? How long? How long? Where can I keep it? What you can, can I do? You can keep it in a little Ziploc bag and keep it in somewhere nice and warm. 
I don't. I wouldn't put it in anywhere cold. Um, Why not cold? It'll freeze. It'll freeze. It'll 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 lose its elasticity. Sicity. As you can see, as we're here just playing with this, and it's going all over the place. You can add food coloring to this. Yes. You can add so many different things to your slime. I have a couple of things. Can I go? Well, I think we're, we'll, we'll, we'll show that again at a later series. Mm -hmm. I, I think we're going with the, the fluff slime right now. So happy making. Enjoy your slime. Don't make too big of a mess. And make uh, sure that if you do make a mess, you help mom and dad clean it up. Until then, we'll see you guys later. Have a good one. All right, guys. Have a good one. I, I would wave. Bye, guys. We want to thank Truist for sponsoring this video today. If you liked what you saw, make sure you subscribe below.